Hello, welcome back. I'm Pixie and today we are going to be making a five pointed origami star. You will need a piece of origami paper and a pair of scissors for this one and whatever colour or pattern you want to be on the outside of the star when it's finished, you want face down. To start, you want to fold our paper in half into a rectangle and we need to make sure that all our corners and edges are perfectly aligned and all our folds are precise and neat for this one otherwise we're not going to get the right shape and it's not going to fold down nice and neat and flat at the end. Take either our east or west corner on the top and fold it down to meet the opposite side. So take, for example, our east side and fold it to meet our west side, folding it into a triangle. And this triangle will come halfway down our rectangle. I'm going to open it out again and do it in the opposite direction. And open it out again. So our reason for doing that was to put some guidelines in and if I open it out you can see them a bit more clearly. It's this cross here. I'm going to take our east bottom corner and bring it up to meet the centre point of our cross and then we're going to fold it down flat at the bottom like that. Taking the same point, we're going to now fold it down to meet the bottom, but we're going to do it so that this line here also comes down and meets this line here, making it a triangle. Once you've got that triangle done, we are going to roll this part in to make another point. And to do that, we're going to take the bottom edge here and we're going to make it meet the centre point here, like that. And fold. Once we've got those two folds in place, where it now meets in the centre, we're going to fold it down and flatten it out and this will give you a side that's fairly neat and a side that's messy on our messy side you'll see we've got this fold here that makes a triangle we're going to cut along the bottom of the triangle so that the triangle is now all we have and open it out and if you've done it right, you'll have a pentagon. We are now going to use these two lines here as a guide to bring our bottom up. And what I mean by that is both our corners here are going to come as close to meeting that line as they possibly can while remaining straight. And then we're going to put the fold in like that. So we brought our bottom up and we used our corners and these two lines here as a guide to where to put the fold and we want it where those two lines almost meet the bottom open it back out turn it round and do the same on all five sides
and when we've done all our sides we're going to open it back out you'll see now at each of our points we've got a diamond shape and a line separating it we want to make it so that all these lines some of them point in we want to make it so that they all point out most of them will but we do that by just pinching it in from the outside all the way down to the bottom of our diamond and that will bring our edges up here we want to carefully just bring them down on top of our pentagon and we'll have this sort of fin shape here bring the fin shape down so that it points out so see if you were to bring it down here it's gonna it's not gonna look right we want it to point up and out not down and out so up and out and flatten it and do the same with each side so we'll show you again we're going to pinch it at the top bring it all the way down to the edge of our diamond and our sides have gone up we're going to push those sides down onto our pentagon and bring our fin down so that it points up and out and then just flatten i'm going to do it at every point The ones that point out are going to be a little bit more fiddly, but just be patient. They will fold in by themselves. And once you've done it on all five points, open it back out. Take any point and do just the first step again. So pinch it till the sides come up and then stop. Take either of our sides that are pointing up here and pinch them and do the same. Like that. Let go of our first one. Take the next one and do the same. And just repeat all the way around with all five and that will leave you with all our edges pointing up what that's now going to allow us to do is take either two points that are next to one another and we're gonna loosely and gently fold them down in the same direction and we're going to follow the same pattern as we did last time so just keep hold of the last one we did as we do the next one again can feel like they're not gonna fold but they will and once they're all done you'll have this loose sort of gathering just carefully go around each one and fold it flat like that and that's the back of our star once we've got it nice and flat and all our points straight turn it over and now you've got a pentagon as well as the points Take any corner of the pentagon and the point of B star it's attached to and roll it in. So this point comes into the centre and we are folding our point in half. And then just make the fold nice and flat and open it back out and repeat on all five sides 
again, some of them are going to feel a little bit fiddly, like they're not going to go into the position you want them to be in. Just be patient and they will. Once you've done all five points, open it back out and then carefully start to fold them in loosely. So don't push them down, just loosely fold them in. And the first four are going to go over one another. So as you fold it, they'll fold over one another. When you get to the last one, you're going to fold it down as though it's going to go over them, but it's not. It's going to go in to the first point we've done. Like that. So as you can see, they're all loose. We've got all our folds where we want them to be. And now we're just going to go round. And we're going to patiently just fold them all nice and flat. Again, it might feel like they don't want to go into the position you want them to be in. They will. You've just got to be patient and just go around it very carefully. Just fold it nice and flat. And there it is, a five-pointed origami star, that's the back, could use the back as the front if you wanted, but that's the front. If there's anything you would like me to make origami wise let me know in the comments if you would just like to see more please like and subscribe and if you give it a go and you make an origami star let me see yours i am on twitter instagram tiktok you can show me yours on there thank you for watching bye <laughs>